When I was about four years old, my father took a piece of paper, folded it a bunch of times into an airplane, and sent it sailing across my bedroom. I was in awe. The fact that something as simple as paper could fly so easily was just so cool. Now there's one innovator who has one-upped my father in the paper airplane department because his piece of paper can be flown as a drone. Here's Albert Lawrence to explain. Paper airplanes are the perfect way to challenge your mind, have a little fun, or distract you from boredom. But the reality is, they just don't fly that far. The one playful innovator who used to be a pilot outfitted these low-tech flyers with some high-tech gear to make paper airplanes you can actually control. I flew on a regular plane to New York City to meet up with Israeli Shai Goitin, who teaches kids about aerodynamics in a fun way with his Power Up toys. Can you please talk to us about Power Up? Okay, so Power Up is all about taking the pastime classic paper airplane and bringing it to the future by connecting technology to that very simple paper airplane. I really all started working with immigrant kids, teaching them aerodynamics, and doing the research of and planning the course, I found all these different new technologies that there are. Carbon fiber, micro motors, microcontrollers, and it just came to me, you know, this eureka moment, uh, what happens if we Take that paper airplane that you fold in a few seconds, put the technology connected to it. And that question actually evolved into the first model, which is what we call the Power Up uh, 1 and 2, which is just this, uh, this very simple paper airplane and the propulsion unit. What we did is we connected this supercharging unit. We just slide it to the front of the nose and it's ready to fly. You have the rear propeller. So this is the very first model. Yes. So then what happened after this? The next generation one that we developed, which is the Power Up 3, it's the same idea, same uh, connector, but this time we have a Bluetooth module that uh, you can connect to your smartphone and this little rudder on the rear that you can control it with your smartphone as well. But Shai didn't stop there. His next iteration was a paper airplane drone controlled via its own Wi-Fi hotspot. And it also comes with a live streaming HD camera. This camera gives you a front view so you can see what your airplane sees, but it also can rotate to the rear. So you can actually see the rear point of view. So when you take off, it'll photograph you and you can see yourself actually launching. It's a kind of a selfie mode. Before we went flying, Shai taught me how to fold the perfect paper airplane using the templates that come inside every kit. The folds should be as symmetrical as possible to increase lift and flyability. That's it. Ooh, You're all set. This looks like a proper paper airplane ready to take flight. We headed over to Central Park with Shai's son, Ido, to fly our planes, which are controlled by an app on your smartphone. You hear that sound? Oh, it's revving up. Revving up. OK, so we're going to launch it this direction. The paper plane flew perfectly, and so did the larger drone version. Shai gave me a few quick lessons, then let me pilot the Power Up 3 plane. Ah, we got it! Good! <laughs> you did it! Wow, I mastered it so much <laughs> that I hit myself. Let's just say it's a good thing these planes are made out of paper.